Example 5. Solve a compound inequality with OR. Solve 2x plus 3 is less than 9. OR 3x minus 6 is greater than 12. Graph your solution. Solution. Solve the two inequalities separately. 2x plus 3 is less than 9. OR 3x minus 6 is greater than 12. We're going to start on the left hand side. I realize I'm working with an equation that involves two steps, multiplication and addition. So we're going to subtract 3 from each side because we do the opposite of what we read. So on this side I put a negative 3 and on that side I put a negative 3. Now a positive 3 when combined with a negative 3 that goes to 0 so I bring down my 2x because that's the only thing left. 9 minus 3 is 6. Now I have a one-step equation and it's read 2 times x is less than 6. I want to get the x by itself. What's the opposite of multiplication? Division. So I divide both sides by 2. What's 2 divided by 2? 2 divided by 2 is 1. And what am I left with? 1x. 6 divided by 2 is 3. So now I'm at x is less than 3. Okay, now let's go solve the equation on the right. 3x minus 6 is greater than 12. Once again, two-step equation, multiplication, subtraction. That says a negative 6. To get rid of it, I must add 6 to each side. Plus 6, plus 6. A negative 6, when combined with a positive 6, that goes to 0. So both these 6's are gone. And I'm left with just 3x. 12 plus 6 is 18. Now I'm at a one-step equation that involves multiplication. The opposite of multiplication is division, so therefore I would divide both sides by 3. 3 divided by 3 is 1, so I'm left with just 1x. 18 divided by 3 is 6, so x is greater than 6. So the solutions are all real numbers less than 3 or greater than 6. All real numbers less than 3 or greater than 6. Because it says or, I know my graphs are going to be going in different directions, away from each other. So x is less than 3. I locate the 3, circle it, but do not shade, and then darken in the less than direction. x is greater than 6. I locate the 6, circle it, do not shade, because it doesn't say equal to. Same here, it didn't say equal to. And since it says greater than, I shade in the greater than direction. And with that, I am finished. That concludes today's lesson.